Here are all the materials I need for my outdoor bodyweight gym. I've got five 4x4s that are treated. I also have another one up uh, in the garage. I've got three four foot long, one inch diameter black pipe. And I also have two that are at three foot long. I've got 10 flanges to fit those one inch, four elbows, and four uh, three inch nipples, I guess they call them. We've got uh, nice heavy duty screws that'll go work well in here, as well as some six inch dimmer bolts that'll go in here. If you're gonna do this, make sure that you have screws that are rated for pressure treated wood. This is probably overkill, but I also bought three cans of paint. I want something that so that the metal doesn't rust. All right, uh, it's pretty easy to put together. Flanges on each of the ends of the four foot long ones. For the three foot sections here, put a elbow on each end. Take the net hole, put it into the flange. Since these are going to be outside, I want to put some paint on them. And uh, before I do that, I want to just scrub up the surface with some sandpaper just to try and help that paint stick a little better. So it's about 42 degrees in the shop, or five degrees Celsius. So it's too cold to use spray paint. However, what I'm going to do is I've got a spot set up where I will paint on. I've got my pieces inside and the paint warmed up. So I'm, what I'm planning on doing is bringing the pieces out, quickly painting them, and then quickly bringing them back in. I'm hoping that we'll do the trick. The two shorter legs are 41 inches tall. I barked 40 inches up 
on both the short leg and the tall leg for both sides. And that's where the top of the flange is going to go for the bar. You want to use a drill bit for a pilot hole the same size as the shank of the screw. I set the blade to 20 degrees and I have it set on here so that it should go right through the middle of that board. Cut a 4x4 with 20 degree cuts here and here. And this will be a brace down below.
I made this with my dimensions in mind. I'm tall, I'm six and a half feet tall. So I made it four feet wide. And at the end here, it's almost two feet across the back for the dips. You may need to adjust those measurements. And I made the side rails uh, 39 inches tall. Some people might need it more at like 36 or 37. So you'll have to adjust. Thanks for watching. I appreciate the support.